Well, it is an app used by 2 billion people all around the world, including more than 60 million Americans. But now WhatsApp is delaying its privacy policy changes, leading users to download different messaging apps right now. News Nation's Rich Demuro gives us the scoop of some new messaging apps in today's TechSmart. WhatsApp says there is a lot of confusion surrounding its new privacy policy changes, which is why they're delaying them. But already millions have downloaded new messaging apps like Signal and Telegram. But there is a key difference between the two. WhatsApp is one of the most popular messaging apps in the world, with 2 billion people on the platform. But recently, the Facebook-owned company unveiled a privacy policy change, causing users to flock. We're seeing a heightened awareness because it's in our face constantly about how our data is being used. Steve Churchian is a cybersecurity expert. Facebook doesn't have the best track record when it comes to privacy data protection. While WhatsApp still protects the privacy of personal messages in a big way using end-to-end -end encryption, the new privacy policy would allow Facebook to see messages users exchange with businesses. That way, Facebook could sell ads against that data. If I send an encrypted message to somebody, they're the only person with the key to unlock that message. So nobody else can see it, not even the application developer. WhatsApp has now delayed the changes until May 15th, but that hasn't stopped users from downloading alternatives, including Telegram and Signal. Telegram is a messaging app headquartered in Dubai with 500 million users. The company says 25 million recently joined. Meanwhile, Signal got a big boost in downloads thanks to a tweet from Elon Musk. It's backed by one of the original founders of WhatsApp. Signal has grown so quickly in recent days there were some technical issues. Still, it's one of the most secure ways to exchange messages since it uses end-to-end -end encryption by default, which means no one can intercept what you send. Over the last few months, I've been using Signal more and more and been familiarizing myself with the features and its capabilities and what it's been able to do. So I'm, I'm getting a little more comfortable with it and I really, really am proud of their, their privacy stand. Telegram does offer end-to-end -end encryption, but unlike Signal, it's not turned on by default. You have to choose the option for a secret chat before messaging someone if you want the maximum privacy. I'm Rich Demuro, News Nation.